It was a clash of carnival clubs as Cologne played host to Mainz on match day 28. But with precious points on offer in this season's relegation battle, the setting couldn't have been more serious. Cologne were out to end a run of seven games without a win against a Mainz side in the ascendancy under Bo Svensson. But it was the visitors who drew first blood. Jean-Paul Boetius' first goal of the season was sweetly struck and perfectly timed for Mainz as they took the lead just past the 10-minute mark at the rhein Energie Stadion. Cohn responded in kind and mounted all the pressure leading into the half-time. Having struggled from open play, were handed a lifeline before half-time when Philip Mvini was penalised for handball. Andre Duda was charged with spot kick duties and maintained his 100% record from the spot, despite Robin Zentner getting fingertips to the ball. All square after a tense first half, the game took flight after the restart. Just past the hour mark, the hosts finally reaped the rewards of investing more in the game when El Yashkiri popped up at the back post to turn home Jonas Hector's free kick. Dead ball's a key factor for a side lacking a clinical touch in front of goal. Cohn's lead lasted less than five minutes, though, as goal scorer Jean-Paul Boetius turned provider to put the equaliser on a plate for Karim Onisiwo. At two all, the must-win match was being played on a nice edge, but it was Mainz who produced a winner in injury time. Leandro Barrero stepping up for the match-winning heroics as his strike bolstered Mainz's survival hopes whilst denting Cohn's at the end of a breathtaking relegation six-pointer. The highs and lows of the battle to beat the drop on full display. Heartbreak for Köln, but delight for Mainz, who picked up three potentially pivotal points.